Hello everyone, COVID or no COVID? How are you? My name is Rogers, Rogers Running Adventures. COVID or no COVID? Well, everybody gets vaccinated all over the world. Well, most people and some countries are still struggling with it, like India, for example. And so uh, I'm speaking to April tonight. She lives in America, in Chicago to be precise, and I think she has two, two shots. Have you had two shots yet, or just the one? Well, so far I've only gotten the one, but um, that's that's kind of like, uh, they had it on the news not too long ago that that's kind of a regular thing for a lot of Americans right now. I think they said 40% of Americans just have one shot so far. So we're getting there, we're getting to the other one. So you get to the other one, yeah. I should have my mine soon, yeah. And, um, Right, okay, I am the AstraZeneca from Oxford, and apparently I've just read something about you earlier, and it's uh, a very efficient one, despite the five or six deaths they had, but five or six deaths, death uh, for, I don't know, many million people, so the percentage is very low, and um, we all die from something anyway if I can put it that way. <laughs> it is true. Yeah. When we, when we're born, we, we start to die and it's a sad truth, but you know, we try to prolong our life and be happy and not think about sad things as much as we can, you know, getting through this pandemic, I know has been a heavy burden on a lot of people's minds. You know, it's being isolated, being in the house, being scared of this pandemic and everything. When we didn't have the vaccine, we were kind of locked in the house and didn't know when we were going to come out of it. Thank goodness they did come out with the vaccine, and um, I'm hopeful that we'll get into kind of a semi-normal place, you know, sometime soon. Yeah, yes. And, um, okay, yeah, so we have a vaccine now. Well, a few, actually, a few different companies. So I don't know how many companies there are in the world at the moment doing a vaccine, but quite a few, and we, I know there is the AstraZeneca uh, I know there is a Johnson Johnson somewhere, yeah. uh, Piaffer or Piaffer or something like that. Yes, and uh, there is the uh, Russian one, there is a Chinese one. So, but India at the moment is a country that is suffering the most, yeah, with regards to, uh, to this. Uh, but it looks like, uh, but like I was listening to somebody on the radio, uh, she said, no, no, we've, uh, we've been, we have fought other pandemic in the past, you know, so like Ebola and stuff like that. And um, so there is another one as well. We are with children somewhere in Africa. Yes. And uh, so, um, yeah, so humanity is going through pandemic over time. After yeah. pandemic because We're getting that, better slowly, but sure. Yes, yeah, so. that's, that's the way it is. I mean, the pandemic will be over soon fully I, would, I can imagine so i can imagine it could be another one in 10 years time you know a pandemic of some kind or another and um i um i'm i'm just um happy that we do have the vaccinations that we do and some of them are actually finding reactions in people but hopefully it won't be too bad um the one that i've gotten out of here is visor but the one that's kind of suspect lately has been the johnson and johnson but you know, I even though it's it's kind of suspect, like you said, like not everybody has the same reaction to the vaccine. Which one did you get? I got the AstraZeneca. Okay. Yes, and then so um, yeah, so, so they were quite. When I went there, there were quite a few people waiting. Yeah, and uh, but it went uh, it went very fast. Yeah, I didn't feel anything. Yeah, so I didn't have any um, side effect or anything like that. What about oh wow, you? good for you. What about yourself? I actually did have side effects. Um, I felt kind of dizzy and sick and boozy. I was kind of nauseous and I got very, very tired when I got home. But after I relaxed for a little bit, I was feeling better like later that night. But the second shot is the one that's kind of worrying me. But I'm still going to get it done just so I can have it done and over with, get vaccinated and and then I'm safe around other people. I mean, not totally safe, but safer. You know? Safer, yes, safer. Right, so, okay, so I believe in vaccines. Do you believe in vaccines? Yes, I do. You know, I mean, even if you don't believe in a vaccine, I think you should still try to get vaccinated because sometimes it's not just for you. It, you're doing it 
on behalf of other people too, to keep them safe as well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Yes, if you, if you don't do it for yourself because you may not believe in it or something, do it for the people that's uh, around you, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's what you gotta do. Think outside of the box, outside of yourself sometimes. So, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so that's quite good. Yes, I agree with you there. Okay, guys, what do you think of vaccines in general? Do you believe in vaccines? Don't you believe in vaccines? Do you think this is uh, all a farce? Well, no, it can't be, can it? But do you believe in vaccine? Don't you believe in vaccine? Uh, please leave your comment below. That will be very much appreciated down below there. Okay. And uh, it'd be nice to see what you think about it. Okay. And, um, and did you get, if you got your vaccine, did you get in, did you have any side effects? That'd be interesting to know too. Okay, guys, so for now, bye-bye, and i see you in the next video. And oh, by the way, if you like this kind of video, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you.